Hello and welcome to this week's edition of the Engineering News and Mining Weekly magazine published on Friday 1 November 2024. In this week's cover article, Engineering News and Mining Weekly Senior Deputy Editor Irma Fenter writes that the first electric minibus taxis will be piloted in Cape Town next year. By this time next year, it will be possible to tell whether electric minibus taxis are viable people movers within the South African transport landscape. By then, newcomer to the domestic automotive landscape FLX EV aims to have 40 battery electric taxis up and running in and around Cape Town. The engineering news features focus on warehousing and storage, where a new storage and logistics facility is exceeding expectations. Energy efficiency and management, where a collaborative robot enhances energy efficiency and sustainability. And business in Africa, where an engineering solutions provider tackles food security challenges in Africa. The Mining Weekly features focus on mine mechanization, modernization and innovation, where an OEM expands its electric drive and automation offerings and project management and consulting, where technical project management is key to mining project success. This week's business leader is Andrew Hardy, the CEO of payments aggregator PayAt. And as this week's cartoon shows, South Africa's official inflation target band is 3 to 6%, but the Reserve Bank Governor has made it clear for some time now that his target is actually the midpoint. We hope you enjoy this week's edition of Crema Media's Engineering News and Mining Weekly. Be sure to subscribe to the magazine that offers you in-depth news about developments in the real economy by emailing subscriptions at engineeringnews.co.za. Happy reading and see you next time.